Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Jerry Views. In this video, I'm talking about the newly released iOS 10.3.3, which has just been released by Apple to the public. So after six betas, Apple has released the iOS 10.3.3 to the public. So we're going to talk about what's new, the jailbreak status, and whether you should update to iOS 10.3.3 or not. So according to this page right here, the update page, there are bug fixes and improvements in security on iOS 10.3.3. Really, there is not much to it. No new features have been added. It only has bug fixes and improvements in security, as Apple says. So that's the only thing that is new on this update for iOS 10, the iOS 10.3.3. So don't expect to get any new features with this update. You will only get bug fixes and improvements in security. So let's quickly talk also about the jailbreak status of iOS 10.3.3, which currently is unknown. So we know that there is a jailbreak for iOS 10.3.1 and also a jailbreak for iOS 10.3.2. Both of them have not been released to the public, but we have these two versions jailbroken, but we don't have any information whether they support iOS 10.3.3 or not. I really believe that they do support iOS 10.3.3 just because of the fact that these teams have not released these jailbreaks to the public yet. So if these exploits were patched on iOS 10.3.3, we would probably have already these tools released to the public. So I believe both of these tools, the Pangu tool and the Kin team tool, will really will support iOS 10.3.3 and now the path is cleared. They can go ahead and release these tools to the public if they want to do it. So we will have to wait and see if one of the teams will go through and probably in a week or two, maybe we will see any release from them if they're planning to release any of these jailbreak tools to the public. And last but not least, let's talk about should you update or not. So if you're interested in jailbreaking your device in the near, in, in the near future, don't update, of course, stay on the lowest firmware possible. Right now, the best place to be is on iOS 10.3.1. So if you're on 10.3.1 or 10.3.2, stay there. Don't update to iOS 10.3.3 yet. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Also, go ahead and follow me on my social media. You will find all the links in the description of the video.